Hey, what's going on everyone? Nick here with a quick DC news update. So for many of you out there, you've been probably keeping up with the news surrounding, you know, the DC movie universe and what's going on with everything. And yesterday, Deadline actually dropped a pretty interesting article about kind of the rise of female comic book characters and how there's this big resurgence of them and how Hollywood is really pushing them on the big and small screens with things like Supergirl, Batwoman coming to the CW, Captain Marvel, obviously. Wonder Woman last year and now getting her sequel film and you know projects on the horizon like Birds of Prey, uh, the Scarlet Witch TV show and they even mentioned stuff that's pretty far out like Supergirl and Batgirl. But one movie that was kind of buried in the discussion was a solo film about Zatanna from the DC Comics lore. For those of you who don't know, Zatanna Zatara is one of the characters from the DC Comics lore that's part of the supernatural side of things. She's a character that has legitimate magic powers powers and you know is the sorceress with spells and everything but she chooses to use some of her powers to run like a stage show as a magician even though it's real people don't actually know it because of the illusions and things like that she's been featured on tons of dc comics properties i think she was on young justice most recently she was in the justice league unlimited show and she's been in some of the dc animated movies and stuff and the video games so i think a lot of people are familiar with her character she's got a very unique iconic design which a lot of people people gravitate towards, you know, there's great cosplays of her and she's even held some solo comic book series. And what's interesting about this news is that it is another part of, you know, DC's growing catalog of films that they're developing and we don't really know if this will ever see the light of day or if it's just a project on the back burner that they're like teasing or playing around with, you know, maybe we can do it as a Tana film or Blue Beetle or, you know, Booster Gold or one of these characters, but they just never ultimately happen. But honestly, I'd really like to see this character get her own movie because I think it could be so fun and you know what we saw in Doctor Strange's movie and everything well that was cool I personally think DC has a better mystical supernatural magical side in their lore over Marvel which is gonna be possibly controversial but I've always just liked the DC magical side better because they have characters like Satana, Constantine, uh, Etrigan, you know Cersei, other characters I've, I've just always liked that DC magical side better even Dr. Fate, I think, is a really cool character. What do you guys think about this? Do you think Zatanna could get a solo movie? It also is worth noting that DC and Warner have tried for years to make Justice League Dark into a movie, and they came pretty close a couple times, and supposedly Guillermo del Toro has several drafts of the script titled Dark Universe ready to go, which would have featured Zatanna and characters like John Constantine, Madame Zendidu, Deadman, and more. But like I said, I think a solo adventure with Zatanna Hannah could be really cool and interesting and something very unique with the whole female character angle playing in that mystical side of things. But for more updates on Zatanna, the DC movie slate, and everything pop culture, be sure to subscribe to HN Entertainment.